So, I hear some of you might be expecting fathers. And you might need a little advice when it comes to raising your children. Well, come to the right place. Now, sometimes in life things happen that you can't quite control. You just gotta kind of roll with the punches. Like me, found a beautiful woman named Anna. Lovely gal. Not so much of a cook, but that's okay. You know, we took a lot of takeout. It's fine. We had a lovely son. I thought everything was great. Then she turned into a horrible monster. At first I was like, damn. But you know what? I stayed calm. And I said, maybe she won't eat my child. So I let it play out. I've been asked to talk about emotions. Uh, happiness. I've been asked to give you commoners some advice about how to get the ladies, if you know what I mean. Because I obviously don't have a problem with that. I mean, what do I do? I walk around, I speak to them. When I speak to them, they give me things. And the dog got involved. Dog fell off, got attacked. So then I said, well, it's okay, it's okay. Maybe she'll come back to life. So I'm like, Anna, babe, snap out of it. Didn't happen. So I had to kill her. That was unfortunate. But you know, in every great tragedy, you have to look at the silver lining. So I'm like, oh, at least I got my son. But then he fell off a cliff. Again, shit happens. It's not your fault as a parent. Sometimes your wife will go crazy and your small baby will fall off a cliff. I assumed he was dead. I didn't bother looking. Anger. All right, so my advice is how to be a really awesome ninja. Uh, first, you gotta dress appropriately. I mean, you know, pick a color that blends in to your scenery because, you know, you can hide that way, right? Yeah, totally. And, ooh! <clears throat> Sorry. Um, and, of course, you gotta be stealthy, which means you have to be, like, super quiet when you walk around. Cool. You know what? It's okay. <laughs> um, you get the idea. Seduction. So yeah, I know what you're thinking. It's a good idea, you know? It fell down the cliff, what you gonna do? It's best to move on with your life, and I would agree with you. Except sometimes, your small child that you abandoned down a horrible cliff with wolves gets rescued by a dwarf, and he survived. But you might not realize this, but then, you know, years later, you come to a village, and you see him there, over a gravestone of your dead wife. And you're like, shit, I probably should look down the cliff. Yes. Ninjas. And why people can't get dates. I mean, honestly, it's so simple. You just have to, you know, have money, exist, be the chosen. It just gets all the ladies to come to you. They're rather fun, you know. And there's a few parties we can take them to. On occasion, the balls are really nice. And I live in the castle too. So having parties in the castle is usually relatively fun. So all you really have to do is have money. Hey, she, Sheena. She'll be back. They always come back. I honestly don't understand why some ladies get a little bit agitated whenever I talk about myself. My advice is gonna be on how to protect the Chosen. Wait, Wait where's Colette? Chances are. <laughs> 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 <laughs>